Okay, three-year-old five furlong maiden on the, on the turf. We've got broadband there for Armacour. Kentucky Grand Duke and Kentucky Lightning. Simon McDougal sold to Rico. Trey Tre Lagaos or Goas. Trey Lagoas. Uh, Grey Caviar, Lock Song, Scooby Nettles, Sweet Child, Darker Fart. And they're away in racing. Slow to begin broadband, a bit like mine, and also Thakafart dropping back from a wide barrier. Then we've got Corrupt just with its nose in front with Sweet Child, Kentucky Lightning, King's Realm, Lock Song, then Sawyer McDougal as they come on down to the three furlong. We've got two groups here, and it's a lickety split up front with Kentucky Kentucky Lightning now putting the nose in front of Sweet Child. Pushing through now is Lock Song, Grey Caviar out wide. In between them, Kentucky Lightning as they come to the one and a half. Anyone's race at the moment. Lock Song, just the leader from Corrupt Sweet Child, Grey Caviar, Kentucky Lightning. Scooby Nettles in there with Trey Lagoas and uh, also, and um, who's one on the row in the yellow, Sawyer McDougal. And they hit the line and it's Lock Song just from Corrupt from then Sweet Child. And that's a grinding win there by Locksong. Corrupt, sweet child. Those first four horses pass the post. You can run that race four more times and add each win it. And goes Zappa Stables, picks up another winner with Locksong. Alan McDonald unlucky there with Corrupt. Same with Steve Brown with Sweet Child. And Frankel Racing and Grey Caviar was very unlucky as well. Then in behind him we had Kentucky Lightning for Paul Rhodes and Scooby Nettles for David Robinson and so tailed out was King's Realm.